Okay. I need to teach you guys how to sing with your playing. Okay. <laughs> and you're probably not going to like it. Some students don't like singing, but singing is very important for music. Okay. Because if you can sing something, you'll be able to play something. Okay. So, and it's a really good skill to be able to sing and play at the same time because you're using two things and it's like really hard. So I want to, you guys to get that skill down. Okay. So I don't care how your voice sounds. A lot of people are like, I don't like singing because my voice is not good, but I don't care how your voice sounds. Your voice sounds beautiful to me, just like your piano playing. So we're going to start with our Amazing Grace, because you guys should be pretty familiar with that one because we played it. So um, go ahead and play for me your Amazing Grace. You don't have to sing with it yet, um, unless you're like, yeah, I can do this. Then go ahead and sing with it. But I just want to make sure you got the chords down. And then I'm going to teach you how to sing with this one. And then we'll do Star Spiegel Band later. Okay, so go ahead. Amazing hey. Grace, what you remember. Good job, perfect. All right, okay, here we go. The way that I'm gonna teach you this is I'm gonna teach you guys how to play um, the melody of Amazing Grace on the piano. Where's my Arrangements One book? Where did you go? Here it is, okay. So here we go, I just wanna make sure it's the same as Arrangements One, because that's what I'm gonna have you guys learn. Okay, it is, so here we go. This is what we're gonna do. I'm gonna teach this. Um, this is on your book, which um, I'm going to send you a book, actually. I need your mom to send yeah. me your address. Um, but I'll, I'll text this to you for this week, at least, so you can have the notes if you want to follow along. But you do need the, the words. So, okay, here we go. The first note is G. Okay. I'm going to go amaze. Okay, then we're going to... Yeah, and actually, I think you can stay in. Yeah, so this is our first position. It's going to be a stretched out G position. So you're you're in with your hands up. Yep. So done. Da, 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 five, four, three, five. Yep. So try that. Amazing grace. Yep, there you go. Awesome. Okay, so go ahead, Isaac. I want you to sing with this now. So you're going to go, Amazing grace, how sweet the sound. That's the lyrics. Okay, so go ahead and try singing as you play that, those lyrics, those, whatever. Awesome. Okay, then we do it again. That saved a wretch, and then we're going to end it differently. So, yeah, there you go, you got it, awesome. Okay, then we have I want, and we're going to be in our C position here, so we're going to move our hand to C position. I once was lost. going to do this thing. But now cross your finger over, your two finger over to this A, was found. But now, so two, one, two, one, yeah. But now I'm found. Yep. Yeah. 
Yep. Okay. So let's try that. Awesome. Let's try that from here. I once was lost, but now I'm found. Can you do that for me? Awesome. Okay, now we're going to go. Yay! Good job. Okay, good job. All right, can you play the whole thing for me? You want to try trying to play the whole thing? Either one works, doesn't matter. Okay, so now that you have the words, we're gonna do the accompaniment on it. Okay, so you're gonna do your sorry. Okay. And this is let's see, you don't have the sheet music, so but let's just try it. I just want to see if you can use your ear. So it's gonna go, uh, you'll say the word uh before you start the piano. Amazing grace, how sweet the sound. Okay, you want to try it? Just see if you can do it. Uh -huh. Then I'll help you. Okay, go ahead. Uh huh. Now when you play Amazing Grace, and I'm gonna try have you play it this week for me, um, uh, sing with it, okay? So any accompaniment, accompaniment song, which accompaniment means just playing the chords, any song like that, you're gonna sing with it, okay? So the other song we have is our um, Star Spangled Banner, okay? So let's go to our Star Spangled Banner, and um, we're gonna learn, do you know the melody to Star Spangled Banner? Let's see, wait, where'd it go? Like the music, like the word? Yeah. yeah. The, okay. Oh my gosh. Come on, paper. Go to the page. Huh? Okay, so. Oh, say, can you see? It's kind of high. You can also go, oh, say, can you see? Lower. Oh, say, can you see? Whatever one you can reach. <laughs> Okay, so um, we're gonna start. Do you know the lyrics to it? It's a lot of lyrics, so I can show on my. I have the lyrics. Oh, you do? Awesome. Okay, so go ahead and I'm just gonna have you sing with it. And if you want, you can pluck it out on the piano, but because I think you might be able to pluck it out on your with your ear, but I don't know. Yep, start to the D. Oh, say, can you see? So go ahead and sing that part. Let me see if you can. That's a good one. Good job. Awesome. Okay, now this is a really high note. Yep. By the dawn's early light. Yep, keep going. There you go. Yep. Proudly we know. 
fun. notes better than I can. Okay, so now what we're going to do, this one's a little bit more tricky to play with the accompaniment chords because you have some, you know, sometimes you're playing one, two, sometimes you're playing three, and so um, do you have, let's see, what paper, do you just have just the lyrics or do you have the chords above the lyrics? Like this? Oh, awesome. I have this. Okay. Perfect, that's what you need. Okay, so Okay. I'm going to have you try it. You're going to follow, like, sing the lyrics and play the chords that are above the lyric. Okay. And you, I mean, it's the same thing. One, two, one, one, two, one, one. Like, you already know it, but you can see where the lyric and the thing line up. So, um, okay. Let's try, let's try it. We'll see what happens. So, a G is your first note. Oh, and you'll say, sing, sing, oh, before you play your chords. So, oh, <laughs> I told you it's a challenge but it's really good for you so um, that little end part the home of the brave that you're gonna do home, home. Oh, I gotta do it lower home because I can't go home so I <laughs> home of so of the oh, of the so it'll be on of and the of the brave so yeah. Okay. Good job, Isaac. That was perfect. You learned that way faster than I thought you would learn. So, um, I'm a quick learner. Yes. You have a quick. Except oh, you're a quick learner. I thought you said I have a quick question. Did you say you're a quick learner? 
Uh-huh. I'm okay. a quick learner. Ex- yes. Everything yeah. except for guitar. I can't pick up guitar. <laughs> except for guitar. <laughs> you know, I'm the same way. Guitar is really hard for me. It's my fingers uh-huh. don't do it. It hurts too much, and then I give up. But the piano doesn't hurt your fingers, so. Uh-uh. I have no. to multiple times to learn the guitar. <laughs> learn. Piano is an easy skill. Yes. It's an easy and it's fun. Um, so, okay, let's see. We've got a little bit of time. We're going to go to our reading book. And um, you don't have the reading book yet, right? Or do you have it? Okay, I'm also going to send that to you. Let's see, reading for them. Um, okay, also. Rhythm thing? Yeah, did you send me your rhythm thing? Did you do one? Mm, I'm not sure 100%. Okay. Not 100% sure. If you did it or if you sent it to me? I don't know. Both? Okay. <laughs> All right. So Samuel did do one and he did send one to me. So, wait, I think. Oh, I might. I think it that somewhere. Me one, actually. I'm pretty sure you sent it to me. I think I have it. Because I remember you did it and Samuel didn't, and then Samuel did it. So. I think I, I think I sent you one. Yeah, you did. Of my rhythm sheet. Yeah, you did. Uh, yes, I did. Yeah. Okay, when Samuel's back next week, hopefully, we will do those rhythm sheets. I'll have you play Samuel's and okay. Samuel play yours. I'll try to find it. Okay. Um, I have it. You sent it to me, so I have it. So you don't have to find it if you can't. So, um, okay, our rhythm. We need to do the names of the notes. So here we go. Note names. And I actually need to go get my board. I'm like, what? The, ma- the Masters of Rhythm 47.17.27.3. Wait, is that what we were on? Are we doing the Masters of Rhythm 7.1 through 7.6? Did you, uh, yeah, let's see. I think Eight. I did that. Did I do that with, um, mm-hmm. no, I didn't do that with you yet. I don't remember doing, I don't no, remember I doing page 15. Okay, um, but I just want to teach this to you really fast because we're going to be doing these ones, um, like every week. Anyways, they're like practice. You shows. want me to do page? Um, while I go find actually, let's see. Maybe I'll wait till Samuel gets back. To- I have page fifteen right now. What? I have page fifteen. Oh, perfect. I have page fifteen. Okay, go ahead and play all of fifteen for me. Actually, instead of I was gonna go do that, but I'm gonna wait till Samuel gets back. Um, because you guys also have to get something. For her. Anyways, okay. Um, go ahead right. and start from the beginning and count out loud as you play, and we'll just go from the beginning okay. to the end. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven,
Awesome. Perfect. Okay. That's all I have. Perfect. Um, I'm going to send you the book this week. So hopefully you'll get it this week. I can send it to you on Friday because I will have a car. Okay. I don't have a car until Friday. So I will send you lots of books, actually. I got a lot of free books. So I'm going to send you a big bundle of books so you can have them. Okay. Um, so next week you'll have the book so we can actually do this next page. Um, and what we're going to do next week, I need you guys to get your discs. Um, so in your packet that I send you, you're going to have this round disc. Okay. So make sure to bring that disc and also some scissors. Okay. And then Samuel needs to print it off. I'll have to text him, tell him to print it off on his online thing. So, all right, cool. So you got the Star Spangled Banner you're going to be singing to as, as well, a lot of, as well as your amazing grace and then uh, we didn't really learn anything too new this week so um yeah do you have any questions before we end isaac no when you said disc and scissors i thought what the first thing that came to my mind is we're going to be cutting the disc yes we are we're going to be cutting the disc oh what? yep why because so, uh it will make sense I figured out how to ruin a disc without cutting it. Well, it's not going to be like, it it's just a round piece of paper. Not like a disc disc. Oh. It's just a round piece of paper, which is called the disc. So that's okay. what you'll bring. And, and it will be in your packet. So um, it should okay. be. Um, okay, Why cool. Because it with- it's part of what we're going to learn. We're going to learn our notes next week, and the circle paper is going to help you understand why they're called the way they are called. So, all right. Okay, good luck practicing this week, and uh, hopefully you get the books this week. We can do that next week. So, all right. Good luck. We'll see you next week. Bye.